So what is up YouTube, BodyRot420 here and today I'm bringing you guys another video on how to get weapons fast in Rust or how to get weapon blueprints. So first you want to start off with your level 1 workbench. So scraps mean everything when it comes to getting blueprints. Um, just anything in game that you don't have. So when you go to your, your workbench here you'll have an option to put in your scraps right here on the top and you can do an experimental uh, blueprint. And what that does is it'll charge you 75 scraps and it'll just give you a random blueprint. And you just keep doing this until you have, you know, your basic guns. A level 1 workbench, um, it'll give you anything between, you know, a revolver, pistol bullets, um, double barrel shotgun, you'll get a water pipe, bean can, and satchel charges, um, shotgun traps, and those are what you can get with a level 1. There's also a list of other stuff but you just want to keep doing this until you get a weapon. So let's just see if I can, you know, get a revolver or something. Huh? And there we go. We finally got a gun out of that one. Oh, another one. All right, and you guys want to do the same thing here um, on your level two workbench. On a level two workbench, you can get anything from road sign um, gear and coffee can helmet. You can get a python. You can get the semi-automatic pistol. You can get the semi-automatic rifle. You can get the Thompson, the custom SMG, the pump shotgun, the flamethrower, 5.56 ammo, shotgun ammo, the medical syringe, and then auto turret. So you'll just do the same thing. You'll just sit here and do this until you get a random experiment. Um, and it costs about 300 scraps each. And this is how you get your T2 gear. So we'll just keep doing this here until we get, you know, a different gun or something. And we'll... There we go. And we got the pump shotgun. That was fairly quick. Um, so let's go ahead and learn both of these. I already know that. So, all right. And then on the workbench level three, once you get to a workbench level three, you should have, you know, pretty good you know weapons and armor and everything once you get to this SARS and everything so this is how you create your C4 your explosives this is how you get your AK-47 blueprint your MP5 the bolt rocket launcher and your metal chest and face gear so with the workbench level 3 it costs about a thousand scrap per experiment but there's not very many items on this list so normally it doesn't take you very much to get something very good um, I'll also put a link to the oh, rocket launcher right off the bat. There we go. I'll also put a link in the description on everything that you can get per workbench. Um, I'll also make another video on how to get scraps if you guys don't know how to do that. Uh, if you guys liked and enjoyed this video and this helped you guys out a lot, please give me a like and please subscribe down below and check out some of my other solo survival videos. And uh, you guys have a great day and I'll check you next time.